Welcome back to Flash Custom Transfers. If you're new here, my name is Chelly. If not, welcome back, welcome back. Today we are doing a direct to film Father's Day gift project for my son. So today's gonna be featuring Donovan's domain. Please be sure. Please be sure to follow him. I will link him in the description below. So today we're gonna to be showing you basically how easy DTF is, how easy pressing is, all of this, even a 10 year old can do it. So let's go ahead and get straight into it. Um, let me show you. So right now I am having him cut up his sheet. So this is a 22 by 24 sheet right here. Right now they are on sale for $15.99. Do you want to explain what's on your sheet? So tell us a little bit about what's on the sheet. So first of all, who is this cute little boy? That's me. <laughs> okay, go ahead. And this is my this is me and my dad's dog Brutus. He he died a couple weeks ago, so I'm trying to surprise him with um, shirts for Brutus. Oh, okay. So this is a Father's Day gift. Yes. Oh, so did Brutus have wings? No. Oh, so what is this? I honestly don't know. This is what a graphic designer created for you, right? Because we wanted Brutus, because Brutus went to doggy heaven, so we wanted him to look like an angel. Or we could tell them about the incident with the professional. No, it's not. <laughs> well, we sent, what happened is we sent this image to our graphic designer and we asked her to hook it up for us. And they put this dog right here in the halo. Very yeah, I'm not halo. sure what she was thinking, but this is what I wanted. I explained it and she put him tiny tiny right here so it was kind of silly we were just laughing um so these are just some photos um that mean a lot to my son um with the dog brutus we got brutus before donovan was even born so he's been a part of donovan's life his entire life so today he is we bought a few shirts she's got eight eight and like seven or six yeah um, so we bought a few shirts, so he is going to be cutting up. Go ahead and finish cutting up. Oh, so we cut this one up, and we're trying to find the right shirt for that. Well, I don't think, remember we said not white because of the wings were white. That looks good. Yeah, Ooh, that looks really good on that black. Yeah, we can do this. Okay, perfect. Let's go with the next one. I like that. I thought it wasn't gonna um, blend well because of uh, Brutus and the black shirt, black dog, black shirt, but that looks really good. The wings pop out. Do I cut this off? Again? Yes, good question. What was the question? Do I cut this little thing off right here? Yes, every sheet comes with a file name. So this file name is Donovan Brutus. So always remember to cut this file name off because it will press on your garment. So good question. Go ahead and cut that file name off. And this is good for everyone watching because I have had a few emails where people have contacted me where they accidentally pressed their file name. Please do not press your file name. Cut it, trim it. 10 year old showing you how to cut it, trim it. I believe this is your shirt, right? Uh, no, this is mine. You can just chop it up right there. Yeah, it's this okay if, oh, okay. It's okay if it has excess, cause nothing, if there's no ink right here, it's not gonna press. So we're all good on that one. So white shirt. Okay, you can lay this on top of that one. Just so we'll have some room. Yeah, lay it on top, lay it on top. So this one is going to be it's the last shirt for Dave. The big writer one? Yeah, All it's right. Going to be the last one for Dave. Go ahead. Oh, then we have a mini shirt for the mini mini boy. His mini boy. <laughs> so then we're going to go ahead and get it pressed. We have our heat press right now set at 312 12 seconds. Cool to touch, and then another six seconds. Perfect. 
perfect. Look at him, already got his routine, his little system down. Oh, see, I knew that was gonna be really big. So this is probably, whew, a 12 by 14, I think, right? Yep. Which was, or maybe 10 by 14, something like that. Yeah, Very, 10 by, 14. 10 by 14. Very large photo, but he wanted it big and bold. This is an extra, hard this is yes. That's an extra large shirt, so pretty big. And then he got a kid's shirt to match. So cute cutest kid. All right, let's go ahead and press them. Okay. First one. Let's, which one are we going to do first? We're going to do yours first? Yeah. Okay, well first let's put this shirt on there by itself. So this is a how to press your DTF transfers. Let's turn this light on. Hold on, we gotta make sure everything is flat. You see how it's jumbled up here? So let's flatten it out. This is jumbled up. You see how this, we gotta make it flat. Let's go ahead and press all the moisture out. Hold on, gotta get it nice and flat. Give it a little pre-press. Get some of those wrinkles and moistures out. Okay, go ahead. Now put your photo in there. Well, what we wanna do is Oops. find the middle. So this is the middle. Move this real quick. So you see where this tag is? Mm -hmm. So we put this straight down. So then that's the middle. Let's fold this. Then what's the middle? Fold this corner to corner so, I can sh so we can see what the middle of this is. Like this? Yeah, put these corners of the photos and line them up. It's not even. It's, it's okay. So even. now pinch this. this right there so we can see what the middle is. Okay. The middle of my face is the middle. Okay. So see this line? Yeah. Now that's our middle. So let's go down about two since it's a kid's shirt, but we need to go right here too. Cause this is this is nothing. So this it needs to start at the oh. at the there we go. So hold this tight because I'm gonna move this and I don't want it to move. Perfect. Wait. What do you see? What's the issue right here? Show me what the issue is. This is hanging off. Correct. That is hanging off. So we need to pull the shirt up. There we go. Carefully. Perfect. This is a little crooked. All right, so there we go. So always remember, make sure the image is not hanging off. Make sure it is straight. Make sure it is lined up. And then we'll give it a good press. You need help pressing? This one's kind of hard because I made it have hard pressure. I might need to loosen up the pressure a little bit. Yeah, you might have to. What? Your 10 year old muscles can't do it. Hold it tight. Keep holding it tight. Okay, let it go. Okay, now we need to cool to touch. So now it needs to cool down. This is what I've been using. Alora's painting? Yeah, Alora's painting. Cool it. Won't fan it. I don't think it's going to... Is it really going to turn out well? Because I see spots on it. Good question. It is going to turn out well. He said he sees spots. So right here you see a spot, is right it here. Touch? It is kind to, oh yeah, go ahead. Wait, what? Go ahead, be careful though, Do hold this down. You already get to peel it off? Yeah, corner to corner. Since this is already lift up, go with that corner. So he asked, is it going to press right? Because he sees spots. As you can see, the spots are coming up off the film. Spot, spot. There's a little spots, yes. With That's why it's very important to always do the second press because it solidifies the print and the shirt, gets rid of everything, smooths it out. Go ahead, six seconds. Six. As hard as you can. Come on, muscles. Come on, muscles. Lift up the thing before. I Come on, muscles. Okay, go. Ooh. 
So where's our spots? No spots. Didn't it smooth everything out? Ooh, yes. pick it up. Yes, be careful, it is hot. Pick it up by the um, shoulders so you can hold it and I can see. Ooh, it's like looking in a mirror. <laughs> This one is one and done. All right, let's go and then we'll do the rest of them. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, set the camera up so it can see us do the rest. So this is going. All right, so we gotta measure it up. Oh shoot, this is a big daddy one. Okay, okay. so about four. Oh, well this Five. one is gonna be big. So let's pinch the corners. Let's see what our middle is. No, not the corners of this, the corners of the photo. Oh, that's how we know what the middle is. Well, we have our crease so we can see. So let's yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Oh, okay. No, we're gonna go up, up high. Probably about two because it's such a large. And we might have to press this in two. Let me see. I don't know that actually. Okay, so that's like 15, 14. All right, go ahead, give it a good press. Hard. All your strength. Strength, strength, strength. Ow. You got it. Four more seconds. Two, one, beep. Okay, give it a good wave. Okay, how's it feeling? Try to lift it up a little bit, see what happens. Is it ready? Nope. Keep blowing it. Come on, harder. Let me see. There we go. I'll pull it. Yeah. Oops, excuse me. Careful. Don't rip it. Okay, let's, let's even it out so we can give it a good press. My forehead looks bigger on this one. It's okay. Pull it up all the way. So this can be, yeah. A little bit more. I'm gonna go ahead. Six seconds. Good press. Two. Shoulder, show the camera. More like over here. It's smoking. It's smoking. Okay, let's go ahead to our next one. Woo. Watch out. Yeah. She just messaged me, said she's on her way. Um, there's a little traffic. She, she's, 40, uh, she's 45 minutes away, so it'll probably take a little longer with the traffic. Oh, this is small. Yeah, we need to measure it. Ah. Oh, okay. I should bring this down. Thank you. 
Yeah, this is a little crooked that we have. Make sure you get the shirt straight. You can do three. Hold on. This is wrinkled here, so it'll press on a wrinkled shirt. So you need to make sure everything is straight and flat. Okay. Good hold, strong press. Try to lift it if you want. Smooth. Just go ahead and put it. Yeah, just put it somewhere. Smooth. We'll get it in a minute. We didn't do our second press. Oh, that second press is what finishes it, right? So we gotta get our second press. Go ahead. 10 year old can do it, you can do it. This one looks like it might need another press. Look at, like right here. Oh no, let's just crack some Yeah. <laughs> All right, smoking Joe's. Oh, the corner was hot. Okay, go ahead. And finally, the best of the day. Do corner of the wing to wing. Okay. 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 Let's get our measure. Let's make sure this is straight. Just got it a little crooked. Okay, go ahead. Okay, we'll do the top. Let's make sure this is right. So you're gonna do three? Yeah, I'm gonna do three. Okay. Well, we're gonna have to pause her on me. Yeah, scoop the shirt up just a little bit. The shirt, oh, this, okay, you can do that. Okay, let's make sure this is straight. Okay. Give it a good press, press. 10, 12 seconds. Be sure for these thin lines here, that's got to be super cooled to be able to come up. What thin lines? The thin line on the halo. Keep going. Go oh, this? Yeah.
feet aren't hanging off. Okay. Make sure this is flat. See, there's something underneath it. You gotta flatten the shirt out. Make sure it's not flat. Something No, yeah, it's, it's just, flat. no, it's, I know, it's wrinkled, so you just gotta stretch it and pull it up. Okay. Go ahead. Six seconds. Hard. See, I'm gonna lift up before I push this thing down. You're fine. All right. Aw, so cute. So the camera. Ooh. So pretty. Let me see. I don't know if can see, but there's smoke. Brutus, Brutus. Poor mm -hmm. doggy. All right. Anything you want to say? No. You like the way they came out? Let's see, lay them out so I can see them. I love the way they came out. These are perfect. So nice. You feel that? Very thin. If you don't, how, how would you say that feels? It feels nice. I just, it just doesn't feel, it feels a little, it feels smooth. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, it has a little bit of texture to it. Yes. Does it feel thick and plasticky? No. What does it feel like? Hollow. It feels hollow. So it does not have a thick, plasticky feeling. This one might need a third press because the thing will be. Yeah, I think this one might need another press. It looks like there was moisture in this shirt, and that's why it left some spots like that. So let's go ahead and press that one again. We did not get the moisture out of these shirts, but that's okay. So we're going to go ahead. And these are things that you have to do. It's trial and error. Like I said, everyone's machines are different. Everyone's presses are different. Everyone's shirts are different. So if you're seeing you have a little spots and it needs a third press, just give it a third press. If you see it needs, you know, another, like this one, uh, I think it might have been too far from the pressure. So this one will need another press. And those are just things that happen with your DTF transfers and your projects. All right, let's give this one another press at the bottom. The bottom? Okay. Yeah, because you see how it's kind of didn't get a good press down there. Yeah. So we can just, I'll just, should we give the entire thing or just the bottom? We can just do the bottom, like just scoot it all the way up just so we get a good bottom press. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, but we don't want it wrinkled. Yeah, that's okay. Okay. Just a good press. Okay, okay. That should be good. Okay. Okay, okay. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. Happy Father's Day to all of the amazing fathers out there. And if you have any questions about RDTF transfers, please comment down below, or you can visit our website, flashcustomtransfers.com, or you can email me at order now at flashcustomtransfers.com. Again, we have our Juneteenth sale, which all of our transfers are $15.99. We also have our sublimation, 22 by 24 sheets, which are $14.99. We also have hardware on our website where you can use Afterpay and our stickers. Don't forget about our stickers. So please visit our website for all of our amazing products that we're offering. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we will see you guys next time. Bye.